here we go taking off from Comiagua to Tegucigalpa so I'm headed to Tegucigalpa Tegucigalpa is the capital city of Honduras where I need to run a very important errand. All right, made it to Tegucigalpa. Going to see if I can stay in this place. here in my room in Tegucigalpa and it's now the next morning and I am going to Nicaragua today. However, there is some things about crossing the border in Nicaragua. One of them being that you cannot take a drone into Nicaragua, it's illegal. And basically the thing to do is to send it, to send it over to Costa Rica or whatever. So I went to DHL yesterday and it was a little complicated. I needed to get bubble wrap. They don't sell it there, so, but it's, the place to get it is 25 minutes away. Anyway, by the time I arrived, it returned, got bubble wrap and returned, it was already closed. So now I'm going first thing in the morning to send my drone. So that's what's happening. They open at 8 today, but it's a Saturday, and perhaps she didn't realize it's Saturday, and actually they're not open. I am out of data, so I need to get a new SIM card because my SIM card is from El Salvador, and you cannot refill in another country. You can use the data in another country but not refill it so oh there's a claro here but i don't think it's open let's go check saturday opens at 9 a.m so got an hour dhl um perhaps they open a little later on a saturday and she was just wrong I'm, now i'm gonna go see if i can get myself a juice this is the first time in another country i've seen this many versions of oat milk. Um, I wanna see what I got because I'm kind of excited. First, I got this oat, oat milk matcha. Not a big matcha person, but that's the only flavor they had. And then I got some lemon ginger juice. And then the thing I'm most excited about, which you're gonna think is definitely the weirdest, toothpaste. This is the toothpaste that I get from the States and I cannot believe that it was here. Still a half an hour until Claro opens and hopefully DHL opens. DHL, hopefully it opens at nine. It still has a half an hour for Claro and maybe DHL to open. And I'm still three hours from the border. Okay, headed back and it looks like the DHL is open now and it just had opened late. So Everything done, drone is mailed, got data. Now we're ready to go to the border. Here we are, ready to leave. So I'm off to Nicaragua. And if you're not familiar with the reputation of this border, 
Well, it's not good. I've heard plenty of stories, people being turned away or only given days to cross. And the thing is, I have some unfavorable things going for me. Like, for example, a visa extension, which I've heard from others was not accepted in Nicaragua. But as usual, I don't place my focus there, and I intend that all goes well. tiny little road. It's sort of funny. I hope there will be an overhang when I get Tip, which I will give him. Okay, gracias, buen día. So, wish me all the luck. Yeah, super smooth. They definitely asked for the information about where I'm staying tonight, so it was good to have had a reservation, which I never do. And now is the immigration part, so we'll see how that goes.
perfecto. Gracias. <laughs> Gracias. Alrighty. I cannot believe how well that went. I think I need to do, which is get the insurance. But oh my god, I'm seriously blown away by how that was really not bad at all. It was kind of easy. It was like nothing compared to what I've heard. I can't believe it. El seguro. Ah, okay. Sí, sí, sí. ¿Y tú? Erwin. Erwin. Ah, mucho gusto. Gracias. Gracias. It's finished. Okay, let me put in my directions. My goodness. I can't believe how easy that was. Seriously, that was as smooth as could be. And I am telling you, there is a lot of talk about this border. But I guess today wasn't one of those days. And once I did cross the border, I was rewarded with these insane trees. Perfect, it's really nice. Okay, now I'll just go for a second and get some food. Bank, this is the center. Look at this, so cute. It's cute. I love how everybody's out playing basketball. Go inside. Hola, ¿qué tal? Oh, I made it. And here's the hotel or hostel I'm saying in Nicaragua and I gotta tell you I'm just really happy to be here there's a lot of talk about the Nicaraguan border and how tough and rough it is and I have to say my experience was pretty easy going they didn't rummage through my bags they didn't make me put my bags in x-rays they didn't grill me on questions my uh, visa extension was fine. Um, all things which I've heard from other people they have gone through so I'm really happy. I just feel so grateful that my experience was really easy and that I got in the country because I have to be in Costa Rica soon and my time in Nicaragua is actually going to be a lot shorter than normal because I have to be in Costa Rica and just, I don't know, creating content on the road and all of that. I just have less time than I usually do. So I might vlog in a different way. It might be more of a highlight vlog, but we'll see. I'm just really glad I'm here. <laughs> 